Here's the tropical weather outlook. For the North Atlantic, Caribbean Sea and the Gulf of Mexico, the National Hurricane Center is issuing advisories on Tropical Storm Jert, located about 410 miles northeast of Bermuda. A large tropical wave over the eastern Caribbean Sea is producing scattered showers and thunderstorms. There are no signs of a surface circulation at this time. However, slow development of this wave is possible during the next few days as it moves westward at 15 to 20 miles per hour. This system has a low chance, 20%, of becoming a tropical cyclone during the next 48 hours. Elsewhere, tropical cyclone formation is not expected during the next 48 hours. Here's the hazardous weather outlook for portions of southwest and south-central Arkansas, northwest and north-central Louisiana, southeast Oklahoma, and east and northeast Texas. For today and tonight, isolated thunderstorms will be possible for some locations today and tonight along and near a nearly stationary boundary that will whip north. Strong and gusty winds will be possible in and near thunderstorms. No organized hazardous weather is expected at this time. Temperatures will climb to near or slightly above 100 degrees today with heat index values ranging from near 100 to 105 degrees with brief and isolated higher readings. For the period Wednesday through Monday, temperatures will climb to near or slightly above 100 degrees for much of the rest of the week and through the weekend with heat index values ranging from near 100 to 105 degrees with brief and isolated higher readings. No organized hazardous weather is expected at this time. The activation of ham radio operators, trained storm spotters, or emergency management the personnel will not be needed today or tonight. You are listening to Weather Radio, station WXK36, broadcasting in Tyler on 162.475 MHz. Here's a look at local weather conditions as of 6 a.m. At the top of the hour, skies were clear in Tyler. The temperature was 83 degrees at the regional airport. The dew point was 68, making the relative humidity 60%. Winds were south of 10 miles an hour. The pressure was 29.93 inches and rising. In long view, skies were clear with a temperature of 80 degrees. The dew point was 68, making the relative humidity 66%. Winds were calm. The pressure was 29.93 inches and rising. Once again in Tyler, it was 83 degrees with clear skies at 6 a.m. Around the local area at 6 a.m. in Taro, cloudy and 85. Wind south at 6 miles an hour. DFW Airport, mostly cloudy and 87. Wind south at 8 miles an hour. Paris, partly cloudy and 79. Wind southeast at 8 miles an hour. Texarkana, partly cloudy and 74. Wind calm. Shreveport, partly cloudy and 80 degrees. Wind southeast at 5 miles an hour. Jacksonville, clear and 77 degrees. Wind south at 6 miles an hour. Palestine, sunny and 79 degrees. Wind southeast at 3 miles an hour. And the course at Kamna, partly cloudy and 83 degrees. Wind south at 8 miles an hour. Elsewhere across the four-state region, Oklahoma City, mostly cloudy and 80. Little Rock, partly cloudy and 70. Jackson, Mississippi, partly cloudy and 64. Baton Rouge, partly cloudy and 75. And at Houston, partly cloudy and 78 degrees. Now let's check on your local forecast. Today, partly cloudy with a 20% chance of showers and thunderstorms. Highs around 104. South winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. Heat index readings 101 to 104. Tonight, partly cloudy. Lows in the mid 70s. South winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. Wednesday, partly cloudy. Highs around 104. Southwest winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. Heat index readings 101 to 104. Wednesday night, partly cloudy. Lows in the mid 70s. Southwest winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. Thursday, partly cloudy with a 20% chance of showers and thunderstorms. Highs around 103. Southwest winds 5 to 10 miles per hour. Thursday night, partly cloudy. Lows in the mid-70s. Friday, partly cloudy with a 20% chance of showers and thunderstorms. Highs around 103. Friday night, partly cloudy. Lows in the mid-70s. Saturday, partly cloudy. Highs around 103. Saturday night, partly cloudy. Lows in the upper 70s. Sunday, partly cloudy. 
Highs around 103. Sunday night, partly cloudy. Lows in the mid-70s. Monday, partly cloudy. Highs around 103. At 5 a.m. Atlantic Standard Time, 0900 UTC, the center of tropical storm Jert was located near latitude 36.4 north, longitude 59.6 west. Jert is moving toward the northeast near 22 miles per hour. A turn to the east-northeast with an additional increase in forward speed is expected during the next couple of days. Maximum sustained winds have decreased to near 45 miles per hour with higher gusts. Some additional weakening is forecast, and Jared is likely to lose its tropical characteristics within the next 24 hours. Tropical storm force winds extend outward up to 70 miles from the center. Estimated minimum central pressure is 1,005 millibars, 29.68 inches. Here is your area's open water boating forecast. Broadcast at the top and bottom of the hour, gusts may be higher. Today, partly cloudy with a 20% chance of showers and thunderstorms. Salt winds tend to 15 miles per hour. Tonight, partly cloudy. Salt winds tend to 15 miles per hour. Wednesday, partly cloudy. Southwest winds tend to 15 miles per hour. Wednesday night, partly cloudy. Southwest winds tend to 15 miles per hour. Thursday, partly cloudy with a 20% chance of showers and thunderstorms. Southwest winds tend to 15 miles per hour. Thursday night, partly cloudy. Southwest winds tend to 15 miles per hour shifting to the west in the late evening. Friday, partly cloudy with a 20% chance of showers and thunderstorms. West winds around 10 miles per hour, shifting to the northwest late in the afternoon. Friday night, partly cloudy. North winds around 10 miles per hour shifting to the south after midnight. Saturday, partly cloudy. Salt winds around 10 miles per hour. Saturday night, partly cloudy. Salt winds 10 to 15 miles per hour. Sunday, partly cloudy. Salt winds around 10 miles per hour. Sunday night, partly cloudy. Salt winds around 10 miles per hour shifting to the southwest after midnight. Here's the tropical weather outlook. For the North Atlantic, Caribbean Sea and the Gulf of Mexico, the National Hurricane Center is issuing advisories on Tropical Storm Jert, located about 410 miles northeast of Bermuda. A large tropical wave over the eastern Caribbean Sea is producing scattered showers and thunderstorms. There are no signs of a surface circulation at this time. However, slow development of this wave is possible during the next few days as it moves westward at 15 to 20 miles per hour. This system has a low chance, 20%, of becoming a tropical cyclone during the next 48 hours. Elsewhere, tropical cyclone formation is not expected during the next 48 hours. Here's the hazardous weather outlook for portions of southwest and south-central Arkansas, northwest and north-central Louisiana, southeast Oklahoma, and east and northeast Texas. For today and tonight, isolated thunderstorms will be possible for some locations today and tonight along and near a nearly stationary boundary that will whip north. Strong and gusty winds will be possible in and near thunderstorms. No organized hazardous weather is expected at this time. Temperatures will climb to near or slightly above 100 degrees today with heat index values ranging from near 100 to 105 degrees with brief and isolated higher readings. For the period Wednesday through Monday, temperatures will climb to near or slightly above 100 degrees for much of the rest of the week, and through the weekend with heat index values ranging from near 100 to 105 degrees, with brief and isolated higher readings. No organized hazardous weather is expected at this time. The activation of ham radio operators, trained storm spotters, or emergency management the personnel will not be needed today or tonight.